All right, Sumo fans, we're in the final match of the day here for my coverage of day five and for everybody's coverage because this is the final match of the day. Um, only had three matches for you per usual with me coming home from work, uh, but you got to see all the Ozeki fight today. Here's Abi, the Maegashira 2, taking on our final Ozeki to see action here, Takakesho. And as I mentioned in the previous video, this one is interesting because both men are three and one. So... One loss is now the leaderboard, a number, uh, with all the undefeated Rikishi losing today going into uh, day five. We had three men tied for first place, and they're all now in a way, you know, a big multi-way tie now of everybody that only has one loss and is four and one after five days. One of these guys will go to four and one, and it could be that man there raising his leg, Abi, he'll be on your left, or it could be uh, Takakesho. Not going to raise his leg quite so high. <laughs> and he is 3-1. and one. The other guy will go to 3-2. and two. So, you know, both perfectly still in the hunt for the cup and doing well overall. Uh, but uh, the one-loss group is going to be pretty big. I want to say it's going to be 7 or 8 Rikishi uh, that have one loss, but maybe not. Okay, well, here, I've got the time. Jason, why don't you look for us? Okay, I will. Um, so one of these guys plus, oh, maybe I'm wrong. Maybe only a few people have one loss. Gonoyama, Takeyasu, Onosho, so that's four. Takeyumi, Kimbozan, that's six. Atami Fuji, and Surugisho. So that's eight. Okay, so I was right, about eight. It's just mostly my Gashira ranked guys. Uh, so yeah, the, the top ranked guys, a lot of them have at least two losses. Let's see. We have three Sekewake. Uh, all three Sekewake have at least two losses. Two Komasubi. Both Komasubi have at least, two, well, both Komasubi have the exact same record of three and two, so they both have two losses. And two of our Ozeki, uh have at least two losses or more, and only Takakesho can be in the one-loss group. So he's the only Sanyaku-ranked uh, wrestler who can be on the leaderboard at the end of today if he wins this match against Abi. So that's interesting. Um, okay, so I'll repeat it again really quickly. I tried to put up highlights this morning. NHK quickly blocked them on the channel. Copyright strike. Don't worry. You know, One is fine. It disappears after 90 days. And as long you know, it's three that you have to mat, right? Strike one, strike two, strike three, you're out. So it's the third one, but I only have one. And obviously I won't ever put up those highlights again because I'll know that NHK is going to go after them right away, no delay. So that's a shame because I, I did have, there was some fun matches on day four. So I hope you got to watch them somehow. Uh, tomorrow, tomorrow the iffy thing about day six is... I might have an after work function to go to on Friday night. Um, if I do, unfortunately no sumo and I can't put up highlights. But like I said, solid coverage on Saturday, Sunday, Monday, day seven, eight, and nine. So look forward to that. But I think I'll be home tomorrow night. It, it just depends, guys. I just don't know right now. So I appreciate your patience. If you join the contest and you wanna see where you are against other people, the link now to the public standings page will always be posted in the final match of the day. So for instance, today, here it is. And you look down in the description box and there'll be a link and you can see how you're doing against other people's teams and who is, uh, you know, I guess being lucky and picking the four and one guys for their team. I r vaguely forget who's on my team. <laughs> I'll have to go check it and tell you on Saturday. Um, Saturday, much more fuller coverage. I'll have at least eight or nine videos for you from Saturday. We'll even maybe peek in on Jurio, see what's going on down there, etc. So look forward to that this weekend. Tomorrow night, like I said, I hope to get home to do sumo. But if I have to uh, do some stuff after work, that's life. Um, okay. Thanks for everybody that's been going by. Comments, all the good stuff. Here we go. <laughs>
最後の方はなんとか貴景勝が腕を伸ばしきりました貴景勝の勝ち貴景勝が1敗を守りました4勝1敗阿部は敗れて2敗目です Right, a nice stack of envelopes for Takakesho's trouble, and it wasn't much trouble.、Uh, you're, you're not going to win much sumo going backpedaling the way Abi was.、Um, you're going to get lucky every now and then where the guy hits the clay going down before you step out. But、uh, today was not one of those days, and Takakesho,、uh, no problem pushing Abi out here. It wasn't much of a match.、Uh, boom, boom, and done. And、uh, maybe he was hoping that his hand would go down before his feet went down. But、uh, Takakesho getting it done, four and one. Good for him. He obviously needs the eight to erase Kadoban, so he's halfway there now. And he still has some lesser ranked opponents going into the first weekend. Obviously, next week is when he'll have to fight、uh, you know, the other two Ozeki and some of the other high ranked guys. So,、uh, good for him. Thank you for watching. Sorry about the highlights, everyone. Oh, we got another replay. Wow, not much of a replay to watch.、Uh, sorry about the highlights. It's just the way it is. NHK is really guarding their content, and I understand that.、Um, yeah, you should check out the Sumo Prime Time, see what you thought of it.、Um, I thought it was good. It needed some improvement, but、uh, I appreciate that Hero's trying to do that for the foreign fans. And、uh, I think he's going to do it again on Friday, day 13. Which is the 22nd, and then day 14 or 15, they have the normal NHK World、uh, one hour of streaming、uh, via their website, I think. But、uh, yeah, it was on YouTube. He could take comments. And,、uh, but it was weird. He didn't have any audio from the dojo, so he would just talk constantly, which I know some of you probably think I do that too. But I, you know, pause and turn on background noise and stuff. He didn't have any of the access to that for some reason. So I think they'll make improvements and make it better as they go along. Also, he wasn't showing it full frame for a while. And then in the second half, he decided to go full frame and just speak over the image, kind of like what he does when he works for NHK and he does the play by play commentary. Here's the winners and losers from the entire day. So as you can see, all the four and one people. Um, a bunch of the four and one people in white, as opposed to the orange, meant that they were undefeated going into today. And today is where they got their loss. Like there's Ono Show with his loss today to Gonoyama. And、uh, yeah, zero and five. I think he's the only winless Rikishi now, Tamawashi, up there in the corner. Okay, thanks for watching with me on Thursday. I'll try to be back on Friday. If not, I'll see you on Saturday. Take care, everyone. Peace.